center if you like rounded it around. So that means that the arc angle is Hey, it's not a it's a wedge. I know, but I'm just I'm I'm it's a wedge that probably came out of a cylinder though, like sure. if I cut it. And so that's four. That's two. So what fraction of that cylinder is it? Because I know how to get it's one eighth because eight times forty five is three sixty. Is that true? Yes. Okay. So this is I can just go one eighth of does anyone remember how to get the um volume of a cylinder? Base area times height. Yep. The base area, well, you can only see the top, but the bottom would be just like it. And so it's a circle, right? Would you guys all agree that the oh, base area says so 1 pi r. times, yeah, pi r squared, actually, pi. times pi r squared times the height, we got 4. Radius is 2, so pi. Well, 2 times 2 is 4, though, so 4 pi? Because r is... Oh, for the whole volume, probably, because you just already did all the fraction math, huh? So the 8 and the 4, you did it all in your head? That's awesome. The 8 and the 4 can cancel out, and then that leaves a 2, and then that one cancels out. You're right. So did you just say it was pi? 2 pi. What am I doing? 4 times 4 is 6. Yeah, it's 2 pi. Yep. Yeah, because that would um, cancel out, and then I'd have a 2 here, and that's 2 pi. So you can do that, how, you know. 2 pi equals V. Yeah, is the volume. And we could say unit cubed. Oh, are they feet? Yeah. Yes, they are. So I don't need to write units, or I need to write feet. Feet cubed. That's the volume. That was fun. 10-35. Yeah. Do you have one, Jesse? Yes, I do. 10-44. Okay. Mm -hmm.